And right now, former special counsel Robert Hur was on Capitol Hill today. He testified about his investigation into President Trump, uh, Biden's rather mishandling of classified documents. Hur faces tough questions from both sides. Jen Sullivan has more on what happened. Fiery moments on Capitol Hill as former special counsel Robert Hur was questioned for more than four hours Tuesday by members of the House Judiciary Committee about his previous report into President Joe Biden's mishandling of classified documents. That is Mr. Not a word Hur, that I'm going to continue with my questions. My the line of questioning coming a month after Hur released the 345 page report on Biden's retention of classified documents following his time as vice president. Transcripts from the hours of interviews. Interviews with the president were released Tuesday to provide more context into the year-long investigation. The report, though, had shocking details, which appeared to question the president's cognitive ability. My assessment in the report about the relevance of the president's memory was necessary and accurate and fair. The special counsel did find evidence Biden willfully held on to classified information, but ultimately did not charge him. Writing in the report, Mr. Biden would likely present himself to a jury, as he did during our interview of him as a sympathetic, well-meaning elderly man with a poor memory. Some Democrats, though, accusing her, a Republican, of using language that was politically damaging against the president. You don't gratuitously add language that you know will be useful in a political campaign. You were not born yesterday. You understood exactly what you were doing. It was a choice. Republicans pressing her about Biden's mental competency. Based on your report, did you find that the president was senile? I did not. That, that conclusion does not appear in my report, Congressman. I'm Jen Sullivan reporting.